and self-taught in beadwork, making moccasins through Galia star quilts. Hey honey, watch this. My name is Nadine Morrison. I'm a star quilt maker at White Clay Makerspace. Nadine is an Ogallala Lakota artist who makes teepees, does beadwork, and drawing. But her main focus is creating star quilts. These are given to celebrate and honor accomplishments like school graduations. She grew up on the Pine Ridge Reservation in southwestern South Dakota. Just across the border is tiny White Clay, Nebraska. Not long ago, it was best known as a place selling millions of cans of beer yearly, mostly to residents of the Pine Ridge Reservation where alcohol is banned, but alcoholism is common. After liquor stores were shut down, one became this makerspace for Ogallala Lakota artists like Nadine, who also helps run this nonprofit that provides resources and a space for artists to create and sell. Nadine has a social work degree. Hi, my name is Kim. How did you come up with your idea? The Star Quilts originated from when we were placed on reservations and the Europeans came and they would do a lot of trading with our people and to honor our people, buffalo robes were given as gifts to honor our people and then when the buffalo were gone, we started making Star Quilts, like a Star Quilt design on paper and a lot of times when people tell me what they want in a star quilt, I will color in the star quilt and sometimes there's a buffalo or a eagle or if they want shades of blue, purple, red, whatever color they want. I color them and then I choose a fabric from that. Hi, my name is Alessandra. What are things that you loved doing as a kid that helped you now? One of the things I really loved to do was I loved to read and I loved to follow my mom she would go to wakes, funerals, ceremonies, powwows, to meetings, and I, I really enjoyed doing that because I love to watch people make star quilts or traditional foods, and I love to watch the dancers at the powwow. 